Hello, Psych2Goers. We just want to take the time to thank you for all your kind support. We are a team of dedicated, passionate, and hardworking individuals who come together every day with one goal in mind. We want to make psychology come alive for you. We are self-funded and recently launched our Patreon. If you enjoy the work we do and find it meaningful, please stick around until the end of the video for information on how to get more involved with us and all the cool rewards you can get from us. Being an introvert comes with many struggles, but introverts often internalize their problems, mainly because they don't want to be misunderstood more than they already are. We want you to know that you're not suffering alone. Here are five problems only introverts understand. One, when you really need to be alone for a while, but you're afraid to tell your friends to leave you alone because you don't want to hurt their feelings. Even if you phrase it in a friendly manner, how do you know they won't feel offended? It's always a hit or miss situation, especially if you have highly extroverted friends that always want to hang out. Although they can be understanding and supportive, they may go home feeling stifled, bored, and low-key rejected. You enjoy their company and always have a blast when you get together, but you can't help the fact that your battery drains quicker than theirs. As a result, you're constantly torn between taking care of yourself versus keeping your friends happy. Two. When someone you don't know tries to engage in small talk and your answers are simple and to the point. You're already cringing because it's small talk, but hearing yourself present simple answers that don't add any flair to the conversation makes you feel even worse. It's a sinking ship, unless you quickly do something about it. As a result, you're often torn between taking action or letting the conversation fade until the person gets the hint. Either way, it adds pressure on you to make the decision, which is incredibly frustrating. 3. You've been invited to multiple parties and now you actually have to go because you've given too many excuses. You've already used the flu, house chores, family death, and your other plans as excuses. But how many more times can you use them until they lose their credibility? So now you feel obligated to attend because you don't want to come off rude or insensitive to your friends' invitations. You try to relax and have fun, but after a while, things start to get overwhelming. Halfway through the night, you try to come up with excuses to leave early. Sometimes you wonder if you should have enlisted yourself in acting school. You'd do anything to experience the relief of curling up in your bed just to get away from it all. 4. Presentations. Enough said. Although introverts can be some of the best motivational speakers and move people with their words, sometimes getting up in front of a large crowd can be highly intimidating, especially for those who identify as anxious introverts. Doing presentations often feels out of their element because they don't enjoy being the center of attention. So when they find themselves in the spotlight, their worst nightmares are breathed into life. Generally, introverts prefer making things happen behind the scenes and would rather observe on the sidelines instead of actively participating. Although it may seem like they aren't doing much on the surface, they actually have rich inner lives that are usually more fulfilling than everyday life. Five. People you just met think you're self-absorbed or stuck up because you don't talk or share your life story right away. You're not used to revealing so much about yourself right from the start. You're not trying to be mysterious or play hard to get on purpose. It's just not your cup of tea to be so readily transparent. It takes time for you to warm up to others. You want to make connections and belong just like anyone else, but it's a slow, gradual process. As a result, others may consider you aloof or stuck up, but you're actually just waiting for the right moment to open up. Do any of these problems resonate with you? Please share your thoughts with us below. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our other video, 10 Struggles Only Introverts Will Know. Also, don't forget to subscribe for more content from Psych2Go and check out our Patreon. We started it because we want to grow into a bigger platform that reaches more people who are in need of help. With your contribution, you can receive our PSI pendant, t-shirt, issues of our magazine, and many more membership benefits. Your funding will help us produce quality script writing, voiceovers, and animation that makes our content both entertaining and educational. We want to make sure our community members get the best, and only the best. Thanks for watching.
Hey everybody, I just want to give a personal thank you video for you guys for always supporting Psych2Go and making this all possible for us. Our vision is to make psychology as accessible as possible so that it promotes self-awareness and it helps you guys grow. However, we want to make more content for you guys and would love your support in buying one of these bracelets from our partner, Introvert Palace. Check out the bracelet, it's pretty cool and it even includes Pluto. The link to purchase will all be in the description below and I hope you guys have an amazing day. Bye!